Hey guys, it's Terrarian Worker here. Welcome back to another episode of Terrarian 1.3 Extra Mode. In the last episode, we defeated um, Skeletron we, and we went to the Underworld. So, in this episode, we're going to be fighting the Wall Flesh. And I have built a uh, mushroom, and a glowing mushroom farm. And it's starting to grow. I just got done building it. And I have some potions for the have Obsidian skin potions, calming potions, heart reach potions, archery potions, swiftness potions, regeneration potions, iron skin potions, endurance potions, thorns potions, and hunter potions. And I also have a cookfish, which is the well-fed buff. So I'm going to have some good life regeneration. I'm going to have some good buffs. And I built a uh, hellvader. Well, not, uh, yeah, I built a... Uh, a uh, bridge for the wall flush fight. It's gonna be going. Uh, I'm gonna be fighting him. Let me see. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna be starting right here, and I'm gonna be fighting him. And hopefully this is long enough. And that's why I'm taking the obsidian skins, cause just in case it's not long enough. So I'm gonna be using the hellwing bow. And let me go ahead and put this back up. I was using this to clear out the dirt. So I got a edge off camera, and um. That's basically it. All I did was go get the Mermassa. So, yep. see, we got all these growing are growing nicely, and there's plenty of room for expansion down below. So, really nice house. And I also built a new house. It's nothing special right now, no decorations or anything, but that's because I don't have much blocks to work with. But I will pretty soon. So, let's go ahead and go down to the underworld, and I'm using healing potions. Oh man, I'm nervous. And since I'm not using the bee's knees anymore, I don't need this hive pack, so I'm just going to keep it right here and keep my worm scarf and all that. And I've got 38 defense. Why I don't really need the armor is because of my dense level. Because that's already more than the Fulton for default, So, because I have my accessories reforged really well. And I did that on camera, I believe, so there's proof. Okay, let's go to fight the wall of flesh. I don't know how this is going to go. Oh. That's a bloom one. Okay, we'll have to make a fire blossom farm. All right, so I'm really like I'm. I don't know if I can do this because I've underestimated him, and that's what I normally do is underestimate him, and I end up making my bridge too short, especially in expert mode. It takes so many hit points to kill him. Oh yeah, uh, I had the volume turned up everywhere, so hopefully you guys can hear it better now. So that's why I have to talk a little louder. That lava will disappear by the time I get back over here from the fight. Alright, uh, so, uh, the bridge is about two stacks of 99 total, so that's 1800 plus 108, so it's about, uh, 2000 something blocks long. So, um, I'm hoping that it's gonna be enough. So, yeah, I'm pretty sure that ha that's gotta be enough. Yeah, this Knight's Edge is definitely really good. I'm going to stay right here and regenerate a little bit. So let's go ahead and make a campfire. I'm almost out of wood. And let's make platforms. There we go. Dang it, I hate how they drop lava. Alright, let's just go ahead and do that so it'll drain. Okay, so once we regain our health, we'll uh, fight him, so I'm going to be right back. Okay, we're back. I used the healing potion to speed it up a little bit, so we're pretty much good. And that should be fine, because we won't need a healing potion for a little bit until we're a little bit longer in the fight. So, let's do this. Buff. Let's go. Let's just go ahead and get right here, and we'll get ready. Bum, 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 da, 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 da. Yep, let's do this. The arrows are piercing, so I don't have much to worry about firing-wise. So I can just fire away. Because the hungry, the hungries respawn, so... I only did one damage. Alright, uh... We've got 48 defense. It's like Mithril armor. I really hope I get Auric Halcom instead of, uh... Mithril, because I've gotten full in, like, every single world I've gotten. Alright, we've already gotten down at, like, a thousand. Uh, yeah, we've gotten down, like... 3,000, so that's pretty good. The more you weaken him, the more his uh, lasers do, the more his the more damage they do. So, you just gotta start dodging, even from the beginning. 
I don't really know how to make a guide for this. The only thing I can tell you is make your bridge super long. It's like like, like two stacks of 999 because you're going to need it. And just do that. Like really just jump up and down and you'll dodge most of these ladies. Half health. Uh, we'll keep on the bridge. Oh, there's a shadow chest down there. I did not notice that. We'll have to go get that later. Okay, it starts with a little bit of health. You know, because he's starting to do more damage. So you just gotta be really careful. I think this is where I started expanding. So I'm running out of room. And I've got some terrain to work with, too. Alright, this thorn's about to go out. Alright, I think the bridge is... Oh, no, not yet. They're really close to the end of the bridge, But he's really low. He's only got one, two cap, two K left. Our last stretch. One heal. Oh, wow. It's a little bit longer than I thought, but... Alright, 800 less than the top. Oh, here's the bridge in. Here's the last man. Ah. Our next thing that we need to do is go to the spider den. Alright, let's go ahead and open those crates as well. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. All right, endurance potion, heart reach. Okay, let's make a number two chest as well. Um, we've got a blank one right here. Let me, what did I name that in? Advanced under the common potion. Yeah, uh... Alright, then we'll place these in here too. Sweet. So happy I was able to do it. Okay. Fire blossom seed. So let's go and put this up. And boom, the demon heart. Oh, yes, we got the clockwork assault rifle. Yes. That go ahead. Let's go and replace the hellwing bow. Yes, we got the clockwork assault rifle. Boom. And we got a warrior emblem. Okay, that's alright though. I was hoping for a ribbon too lucky for me, so I couldn't be greedy. I remember when I got two warding shield with the clues. Pwn hammer. Yes. Okay. 25 gold. Wow, he gives a lot. Alright, and just put the money up. And, uh, oh, 100 potion. Plants. Okay. Boom. Alright. Uh, fishing items. Let's go ahead and get these crates out. Let's open up the wares from the best. Here we go. <laughs> Selfish boots. Wow, we got a lot of stuff. Let's go ahead and click stack. Throw that away. And throw that away. Uh, okay. And iron. Falcon blade. Uh, hunter. Calming potion. Okay. Gold. We got that. Let's see. Oh, we got a turtle mount. Our first. Woo! Alright. I'll take that, definitely, because I've been wanting to get a mount. So much bait, though. That's really good. Fishing quests are going to be so much easier now. Alright, I'll take it. We got some ores. And we got platinum, mithril. Oh wow, we got a lot of mithril. So let's go ahead and make the anvil. Uh, and... Uh, mithril anvil. Yes. Put it down. Let's see, what can we make? We can thing in mithril or anything, but that's fine. Alright, uh, ores. So I'm put the hard mode ones down here. Platinum, that goes like right here. Iron, it goes right here. Alright. And we'll just put you up in here because it's a block. Foul. That's pretty cool. Uh, I can't throw that away. Uh, I already have a hand down. So there we go. Um, accessories. Let's put these selfish boots up. All right, I'll take that. Got some more gold. Uh, sweet. So let's arm stealer and buy some ammo, and then once we do that, we're gonna go to the spider cave and get some summoner armor. Uh. Okay, so it's already considered a mushroom biome, so we might get the truffle soon. 
Uh, we do not have the arms dealer. Ow. Okay. Huh. We're just gonna have to deal with this, I guess. 100 bullets. Uh. Alright. That might be a little difficult, but we'll, we'll get him when it's daytime. But what I mainly want to do is get the uh, other stuff. Let me go and get my bow back out. I should probably get the bees instead now. I'll put it there. Man, I'm so happy. Alright, I'm going to resume back in the uh, cave. Okay, I'll be right back. Alrighty, we're back. Before we start farming, I just wanted to let you know that the corruption has gotten everything over here. So we're going to have to start, we're going to have to stop that really soon before it gets close to our land. So, yeah. Let's go ahead and find the spiders. Which should be a little over here, maybe. So I'm going to be really weak against these guys, so I'm just going to have to do whatever I can to kill them. Maybe the bee's knees will probably kill him. Yeah, there's some uh, tough enemies over here. Oh my gosh, only one damage. I have the, the arrows are doing alright damage. There we go, there's the arms dealer. We can probably go buy some ammo now. Yeah. There, we picked up the slings. That's what I wanted. Alright, I'm gonna resume whenever I have the ammo. Right, we're back, so there's a change of plans for this uh, remainder of the episode. I'm gonna batch record another one of me and the spider armor, but uh, this one we're gonna um, we're gonna stop the corruption. That's what I'm gonna do for the remainder of this episode. So this is a really good way to stop the corruption if you don't really know how. You can get something like this, like ash or clay, that will stop it. That you can't spread it through. Like um, if you use mud, it can go right through mud. So don't use mud. It's not that good. And also. Uh, I'm gonna need to build another house because I'll get the truffle and get that mushroom spear because I have enough money for it and I want to have an amazing weapon so I can survive in hard mode and I won't get murdered all the time. Because mushroom spear is ex well, it was extremely overpowered back in 1.2. See, this is why I need to stop it. It's spread fast. Alright, just stop this far down. See, uh, it's right here as well. It's under here, but it can't go anywhere because it's clay right here. It might um, be able to go through here and go around, so I'm going to put something right here, too. Alright, this is good. You only need to go about five blocks. Once you go five blocks, you're good. So once you go about five blocks, you just go back to a point about down. You don't need to go really far ground. Then you just fill it up, and this will cure cancer. Not really cure it, but it will stop it. Once you that, you're pretty much all set. It will not go past that, and you've stopped the corruption from spreading any further. I don't care how far it goes to the right, but as long as it doesn't go near my house, then you just do this. There you go. That's all you have to do. So that's how you uh, stop the corruption if you didn't know how. So I'm going to go right here and stop it right here. And then I'm going to grab some wood off camera, and I'm going to build a house off camera. Uh, I might do it at the start of the next episode, or I might do a fishing quest. You'll see by the end of the episode of what I decided to do, so you'll know. But I'm probably going to do a fishing quest at the start of every episode now on. You can uh, start some uh, things from it, like the angler fishing outfit, and the gold fishing rod eventually, the bunny mount, 
speaking of amounts, look at that. Oh man. That's so awesome. I'm so happy I finally have a mount. Alright. So, that's gonna end it for this episode. Um, so, Cap, yeah, we've beaten the Wall Flesh. Uh, we went and we opened up all our crates. We made an event for Landville and we're stopping the corruption. Um, and I'll check the left side off camera and I'll. Uh, do all the other stuff that I said I would do off camera, like build another house for the truffle to move into off camera and stuff. So, uh, thank you all for watching. Please like and subscribe for more. A like, comment, and subscription would be much obliged. I'll see you guys next time.